how can we renew ourselves and refresh ourselves every day and be creative given all that we're required to do? And what I find is music and the arts hold a lot of powerful messages and tools for us to renew and refresh ourselves. So, that being said, I would really love it if some people would come up and participate. Everybody. Everybody. Now we're going to come together. One, two, three, four. One, two, ready, and stop. Beautiful! How about giving an extra round of applause? Let's rock the house, okay? I can hear more. By the way, if you can help it, don't sit there like this. I'm a very uptight guy, for real, and I have to learn, I have to remember to move my body during the day. Let's move, okay? Here we go. One, two, let's rock this house. Uh. Uh. Possibility. It's one of my different definitions of creativity. It's creating a different possibility for people, right? Or else they wouldn't need our services. Oh, there we go. There we go. Okay. Shabu Baba. Shabu Baba. I'm done. I can't talk. Shabu Baba. Baba. Shabu Baba. Baba. Shabu Baba. So I kind of have an obsession, one more than one, but one I could share with you. One of those obsessions is, one of those obsessions is, how can I, each and every day, be able to renew myself so that I can be prepared to serve those that I work with? I'll be honest with you. I grew up, I had everything I wanted materially. My folks were relatively affluent. We lived in an upper middle class background. But I, I was missing something that really has kind of powered my adult life, which is I didn't have any mentors. And you know, you go to school and you see other kids and they're like, well, this is my mentor. And I'm like, how come I don't have any mentors? Within your organization, Department of Social Services, there are brilliant people who have, if they've been in the organization longer than you, they may have some experience that you can benefit from. You need to seek those people out and ask them, I'm in this situation, what do I do? If you've been in the organization for a long time and you kind of don't have that spark anymore, because that happens too, right? Sometimes you've been doing something too long. I've been there. So ask some of the young people, say, you're so vibrant. You are so awake, alive. How do you do what you do? Seek those people out. I call that kind of the intergenerational 
sharing of knowledge and wisdom. Thank you so much for doing what you do. I'm so grateful to you. Thank you.